Tracy, thank you for letting me see your film. It is the most extraordinary document detailing the inhumanity of mankind in its worst level, not only inhumane with its treatment of the pigs, but it's inhumane in its treatment of the humans who live in the vicinity, the children who come into contact with the water that has been polluted by the effluence from the pigs. The poor pigs don't mean to hurt the humans, but we hurt them. So I would say the real pigs in your film are the factory farmers, the people who don't breed and rear animals in the proper way, the ones that breed in an inorganic way, that have no care for human life or for the pigs they're rearing and breeding. They're not healthy. Their meat is not going to be healthy. And the effluence that leaves these, these oh, hell establishments, these concentration camps for animals, all that waste is spread onto fields. It then flows down into rivers and lakes where children get terrible skin diseases. Then we see the effect, the boils the children have, their skins red and roughened. The few men that work in these appalling places are faced with lung disease, and then there is the use of antibiotics. This is used in the most careless fashion and can only harm mankind in the future. There is also the great danger that is illustrated so well in your film that we have the possibility of MRSA being transferred to the human. So when you, when you go shopping, when you go to the, if you don't go to a farmer's market, look for the label that says it's been organically raised, it's been reared outdoors, and you know that you'll be getting something that is worthwhile eating because you'll be saving life, our lives, our children's lives. Thank you. Thank you.